of Vanity Fair, which is their Hollywood issue, has uh, an article about an old girlfriend of mine who was a wonderful artist and writer named Eve Babbitts. <clears throat> and she gained fame when she was 18. Esquire magazine was doing an article on Marcel Duchamp, the painter who became famous for a painting called Nude Descending a Staircase. So Esquire had the idea that they wanted a picture of Marcel Duchamp, fully dressed, suit and tie, playing chess, with a beautiful nude woman. So my friend Eve Babbitts at age 18 was the beautiful nude woman. And uh, they, that picture has become famous. So I got to know her in 1971. At that time, she was mainly an artist. She did beautiful collages and um, did record album covers, did a famous one of a group called Buffalo Springfield. And she knew everybody in the world. She was born in Hollywood, went to Hollywood High, knew everything about Hollywood, and especially about the music business. The article about her says, by the end of the decade, Eve knew everyone. She was at every party, every event. Life was one long rock and roll, she'd say, of those days. Even fun, though, can get to be a drag if you have too much of it. Writer Dan Wakefield, Eve's big romance during this period, said, Our year together was one of my favorite years, but I couldn't have lived through two of them. By 1971, Eve was suffering from a condition she termed squalid over boogie. It was time for a change.